Uh, welcome to the tutorial. Uh, this time we're going to look at how CCK, which is a hormone, causes bile release from the, the gallbladder. So first of all, a little bit of uh, digestive anatomy. Uh, we've got the, uh, the stomach here, which has the esophagus that leads into it. And coming out is the first section of the small intestine, the duodenum. Off to the side is the liver here, and underneath the gallbladder, and then the bile duct, which leads from the gallbladder into the duodenum. And that's what carries the bile. So over in the stomach again, uh, when you have fats in your diet, as we inevitably do, um, a lot of the lipids are clustered together in sort of large globules uh, illustrated by this. Uh, whereas single lipids that make up the globule would be represented by just one L here. Now the hormone CCK is going to be involved, um, and you'll see how in a second it stimulates the release of bile. And bile is going to go in and cut this lipid cluster down so we have single lipids and then lipase the enzyme uh, will act in the duodenum and break down the lipids for us so let's watch the animation so the lipids are in the stomach they come down and rub the wall of the duodenum the hormone CCK travels through the blood to the gallbladder the bile comes out and splits the large lipids into small ones and now these small lipids can be acted on effectively by lipase so the action of bile there doing the splitting part is called to emulsifying the lipids okay so i hope this uh, helps you